Hey Kevin, how's it going? This is Doc Key from Massive Flying Billboards. So this is the video I did promise I'll be sending out to you. So in this video, I'm just going to be giving you three tips that you can use today to really optimize your website, bring more traffic to your business. So uh, real quickly, we're going to be talking about content, backlinks, and citations. So the first thing that you want to focus on when you're building your site, which is, uh, in my opinion, the most extremely most important, is the content. So content is basically anything that you see on your website, as far as uh, these, this, like this logo, these images, uh, this text here. If you have any videos right and also what these are saved as so if you come in you see that this is saved as logo so this should be saved as like a keyword right so I'm going to get into what an example of a keyword is so Google typically wants to see about 1500 words of content on your front page we put you guys into this word counting and we see that you guys have about 548 uh, words on your front page so Google aim the direction is to really direct that the per that question that someone asks in their query that query to a the website that best answer that and he wants to see about five one thousand five hundred words of content on your front page for you actually to be considered authority now the more the better so if you if you have a competitor and his front page is ranking about twenty five hundred words or fifteen hundred words you want to be at twenty five hundred and so forth and so so on so uh, the, <clears throat> the good thing with this um, content is that you want to be implementing keywords so keywords are basically you know key terms that people are looking for uh, define services like yours so these factors are very important because when search engines use these to f figure out the purpose of your website so within your content you should just want to mention your target location your target service multiple times about several times throughout your pages this is by far the most important aspect of this so you just want to make sure you're doing that so uh, um, example of a keyword if we type in Google painters Virginia Beach right so you can see there's some results here. This is the ad section here, right? We're not going to pay too much attention to this section here. But if we come here to this section right here, this is the citation section, right? So as you can see, there's a few businesses that come up here. I know that Wade Brothers are painting. They're one of the biggest competitors in the area. So these guys is one of the guys that you want to be out, uh, beat out. But when it, upon getting here, what you want to do is that you want to get citations. So citations are they basically lend credibility to your business and help them rank in a map pack. So an example of a citation would be like Yex, Yellow Pages, uh, Facebook is one of them, right? Because it allows you to list your business information on there, right? Just as you would list it on Google. Uh, Angie's List, Home Advisor, right? I mentioned those, but those are not our focus today. So, and the thing is that the more proximity that you have or geographical uh, you know, relevance that you have for your business all over the internet, the more Google will reward you for that. But also to get here is is definitely focus on those citations. You want to make that a focal point. Right, because if your competitors at 50, you want to be at 100. And the place I go to get those citations is a, a software or website called whitespark.ca. But when you get in this map pack, right, this is the three pack, right, or the map section, right, we call it the name, address, phone, and number section. Uh, you want to definitely focus on reviews, right? As you can see, you guys, these guys here actually been in business for 25. These been, this has been in business for 10 years. Uh, it doesn't make a difference, right? They have more. Uh, uh, reviews Google recognizes recognizes that also they may be doing more things right because you want to have more com photos than your competitors and when you upload in those photos just similarly to your website you want to be saving them as keywords right such as painters Virginia Beach right because Google reads that right when they come to crawl a website they don't see the picture they read behind the picture right which is called an alt text so that's what you want to pay attention to also uh, you want to maximize the description here you want to uh, basically uh, optimize that description when it include main include main keywords uh, at least 700 characters on that subscription uh, the best thing to do is when uploading those pictures is like 10 by 24 you want to have at least 25 of those so and that's going to be the way that you're going to really beat out your competitors uh, so in the next step you definitely want to list every city and every town every service that you offer Google allows you to get a free website, so you also want to utilize that, and you want to be posting in there exactly what you would do on any other social profile, such as Facebook, TikTok, whatever you may have, or Instagram. Do it in Google. Google will reward you for that, and you'll get most of the calls. 44% of traffic comes through here, so this is very important. Okay, so uh, this is a software that I use uh, called Ahrefs. This gives me the complete backend of a company's website. So it just shows me how many tra how much traffic you guys are getting. Uh, you guys numbers are pretty low, but it's okay. Today this is the video that's why I'm showing you guys how to actually improve that, right? So if we used to type into Google, right, painting company Virginia Beach, that's the keyword, right? Or painters Virginia Beach, right? These are keywords that you should be included within this content, right? Uh, at least fifteen hundred words, right? So this is one of the competitors, uh, Wade, Wade Brothers Painting, and if we put these guys into the, the word counter here. 
excuse me for that. Uh, we put these guys to the word count, and you see that they, these guys have about 1,545 words. So they're just slightly over that authority mark. So what I would do is that I would go in there and I just double what they have, right? So if they have 1,500, I would at least be at 2,500, right? And I'd be implementing those keywords uh, such as uh, that I showed you on the website. So here yeah, you should, you know, at least you want to have, let's see if you have like Virginia listed on the site. You have that listed like twice, right? But you want to have a keyword like this. So what I'll do is just define off you have it. Right, you want to list this on the site, and, and it's not showing that you have it, but you want to have that multiple times throughout your site and saving those pictures and such. So, if we put these guys into this uh, software that I use, Ahrefs, you can see that these guys are targeting multiple keywords, right? Such as the ones that they're being found for. Uh, they have multiple. So, we're going to get into these backlinks in a minute, but you can see that these guys are getting 140, 144 searches to a website every month, which is very valuable. Why? Right? The reason why they're being found for this stuff is because they actually uh, targeting these keywords, right? So, uh, refer domains, right? So, uh, backlinks are basically, uh, it's a pop, you can think of this as a popularity contest, right? So, as a vote, right? And these can greatly influence your rankings, right? So, the more quality and relevant backlinks you have on a website, the higher chances uh, you're going to rank in the search results and dominate your competitors. So, and it doesn't matter what area you're targeting, you just want to make sure you have more relevance than these guys. So, um, what, what I want to get into is, guys, I want to just want to show you guys some keywords that you guys can be targeting. So these are some keywords, right? So painters, Virginia Beach, house paints in Virginia Beach, exterior painters, uh, Virginia Beach, uh, house painters, uh, uh, Virginia Beach. So we're not going to go any further than that. So we're just going to see, right? So KD, right? This basically stands for keyword difficulty. It estimates the amount of uh, time that it would take for you to rank in the top search results for this keyword. So obviously you see that it's green and this ranges from, from a uh, scale from zero to 100. So this is very uh, easy to rank for, right? Keyword difficulty gives an estimation of how hard it is to rank in the top 10 organic search results for a keyword on a on scale of zero to 100, on, on the scale of 100 point scale. Right, so you see volume. Right, this gets 350 searches per month. This gets 100 searches per month. This gets 100 searches per month. This gets 100 searches per, per month. So easily, I'm seeing about 750 searches per month. Right, so you want to be using these keywords within your content, and you want to be being found for those keywords. Right, and you want to uh, create, you know, good relevant content around that. So as just like we've seen in the search results on Google. Uh, this is going to show us, right? Wave Brothers, they're coming up first, right? But this is how you're going to beat these guys, right? They're getting 123 searches from this, right? So what you want to do to beat them, a quick recap is that you want to be putting that content on your front page. You want to put about 1,500 words of content on your front page. You want to be implementing those keywords, right? And you want to, next you want to do, then focus on citations, right? This is how you're going to get here. So they actually coming up top for Painting Company Virginia Beat. They're at the top. So you want to beat them by getting more reviews. You, got, you guys have a beautiful site, so... Uh, I, I, you know, you just want to definitely improve it in those areas, uh, and definitely use the information that I gave you today to really uh, optimize this section here, uh, with the uh, the description and the photos and the, series, the areas that you're willing to work in, and most importantly, those citations, uh, backlinks. I use a software called Majestic to check out backlinks and to analyze competitors. So that's what you want to use, right? So you start to increase. Uh, this is definitely 100% di directly related to your uh, Google search rankings. So you want to go ahead and get, see, these guys have 37 domains. Uh, I just would double that, right? And, uh, you know, you definitely want to get more relevant ones, right? This is not a powerful site, so it's going to be easy to beat these guys out. But you definitely want to focus on those things. Content, citations, and backlinks. So once you're able to, to uh, implement this uh, kind of strategy, you're definitely going to see so much um, more improvement in your website. So I hope that you found this uh, information useful. If you have any questions or concerns, you can reach out. I will appreciate if you could probably provide me some feedback for the video, but I hope all of the best. Take care.